our first act tonight uh, is a, a young man from Dublin who has a way with a song and he's caused quite a stir in the folk scene. And he's won folk awards and people have made comparisons with all sorts of legendary people. But I'll let you judge for yourselves. Um, let me introduce to you, without further ado, Derry Farrell. Just give me one sec, everybody. Hold on. Good to see you. Great to see you all. How's it going, huh? Looks like you brought the old weather from Ireland. <laughs> and all those jokes. <laughs> well, it's great to see everybody, and it's really amazing to be here, the first act. Uh, and... Um, I'm going to start off with a little song called uh, The Craig and White Hair. It goes like this. In the lowlands of Craig and there lives a white hair as swift as the swallow that flies through the air. You may trap the world over, but none to compare to the pride of low Craig and Dan, funny white hair. Oh, and clear out the morning as you will suppose, oh, the red golden sun or the green mountain rose. Barney caught we came down and he did declare. We search through the lowlands and down through the glens All amongst the wild ditches where the white-haired had ends Till at last coming down over the heather so fair For on behind the wild thistle out he owns the white hair Bang, bang went his guns and his dogs he slipped to As swift as the wind or the green mountain flew but his dog soon came back and it made Barney sigh Barney knew that the white hair had bidden goodbye And we're some jolly sportsmen down here from Pomeroy From Cookstown, Dungannon and likewise the Moy with our pedigree greyhounds, we've travelled from far And we've come down to Corregan in our fine motor car Oh, and into the lowlands these huntsmen did go In search of the white hair, they look high and low Till at last, Barney Conway from a tarpank so rare Shouted out to the huntsmen, there lies the white hair So they called on their greyhounds I'm tired of thee. It was there on the tar bank, all gathered around. Seven dogs and nine men, the damn poor hairs surround. Oh, no wonder that a white hair to tremble in fear. As she stood on her hind legs, she would raise her big ears. And she stood on her hind legs with one gallon spring. She jumped over the greyhounds and broke. It was a beautiful view As swift as the wind Or the green mountain flew But those pedigree greyhounds No, they didn't run too far They came back and went home In their fine motor kite Then there came Another man, and you all know him well. His name it was Mick Kelly with Bonnie Blacknell. Oh, 
search of the white hair today I'll have fun. I'll bet fifty to one my black and yellow will hurt her. this rhyme I hope you forgive me for singing all this while if there's any amongst you up in Carrickmore fair please drink up a help to that funny white hair Welcome to the stage, Mr. Blackie O'Connell and Mr. Robbie Walsh, everybody. I hope. Thank you. Thanks very much, everybody. It's great to be the first act here at uh, Shrewsbury Folk Week, and uh, the, it's, we're going to have a great time, everybody. Is everybody up here in the front bring your dancing shoes and stuff like that? Yeah. Well, you won't need them tonight, because I'm uh, only joking. <laughs> We're gonna have a great <laughs> oh, 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 there's plenty more where that came from. Plenty. More. Well, I think we're gonna have a set of tunes. Uh, we lost, we lost the set list. Unfortunately, everybody will be sad to hear. Hello, everybody. In around 1995, uh, we wrote out a new one there earlier on. So. How's it going, lads? I'll try that again, will I? How's it going, everybody? Yeah. Yeah, I, I, I might try it again, I think. Um, how's it going, Shrewsbury? Yeah. That's better. Think we need to get Blackie a pair of sunglasses. <laughs> <laughs> Did you all hear me? You, we, brought, we brought the weather with us. Are you, are you enjoying that? I missed that one. <laughs> he was playing Pokemon on his phone, that's why.
very cold inside here. And it affects if the you, pipes. If you was all jumped around a bit, probably warm up a bit, so. Could you be hotter? <laughs> no yeah, is the crunching. answer, no. We're, we're already so hot. <laughs> Hold on there for one second now. This instrument, everybody, for those of you who don't know, is called a bazooki. And I think it's actually Greek for constantly out of tune. <laughs> We're gonna sing a song for you now, everybody. And um, <clears throat> the first song that I sung was a song called The Craig and White Hair, and it's one of my favorite songs. And uh, I recorded that on an album in 2009 uh, called The First Turn. This, this song, this next song is another favorite of ours. Uh, <clears throat> and I learned this song from the singing of uh, Luke Kelly, one of the finest folk singers to ever be on the earth, I think. Uh, and um, he, this is an old English love song called The Unquiet Grave. And uh, I'm going to sing it for you now. So I uh, hope you enjoy it, everyone. It goes like this. Yeah. 
the sweetest flower that ever did grow is withered now to store. Oh, and that stork is withered, dry now, my love. And so our hearts, they must decay. A few small drops of rain Oh, the wind that blows I never will see Until you return again Thank you very much, folks. Thank you, folks. Right. Are you all okay? Um, I'm Blackie, by the way. How are you? And that's Robbie. That's Terry. Um, I'm from uh, County Clare in Ireland, right? Count Who's been to County Clare? Oh, the front row. <laughs> plants. They're all plants. Who's um, been to Dublin? <laughs> Who? has been to Dublin and wants to go to County Clare. <laughs> <laughs> Clare's the home of the music. Um, I'm gonna play a couple of reels for you, <laughs> if I can at all. Um, what they are now is as much your guess as it is mine. Um, it says DEA, which could be a euphemism or an innuendo, I don't know. Like, um, the DEA. Oh, the breaking bad stuff. Sorry. Jeez, lads. Can we close that door, can we? It's fine. It's actually fine, Blackie. We close because, that you know door what? and that door. It's actually fine because everyone's been drinking all day, so no one really cares. Anyway, it's, it's actually fine. Uh, How many Ilham Pipers are in the room? Three. Somebody said three. <laughs> <laughs> How do you know? <laughs> That's too many. <laughs> Two and Blackie.
Ash, can we get a bit more bazooki, please? And a little bit more pipes and a small bit more bower on as well, yeah? Stop. A bit of everything, yeah? A small ah, bit more. Stop. You. You're very kind. Oh, God. I'm embarrassed now. Jesus Christ, while well, he's tuning up, I, um, I might tell a joke or something. We could be here for a while, lads. If anybody wants to hear the proper version of these songs, they are on the CD. <laughs> which you can actually purchase off the guys over in uh, Roots, Roots Music over there uh, on the, in the tent. It's, it's uh, great. And we're going to be over there actually at uh, 8.45 signing CDs if anybody would like to purchase what we like to call in this band anyway, uh, a lifetime of happiness. We don't like to call them CDs as much. Not a guarantee. Yeah. There's a guaranteed, there is actually a guaranteed uh, lifetime of happiness if you buy one. Uh, but <clears throat> uh, it's actually, uh, it's, a, it's a great, it's a great buy and there's only 40 of each anyway. So, you know, we don't have a, we didn't have any room to bring any more because we flew Ryanair. <laughs> Cheap and cheerful. This one's the Valley of Knockinore. This one's called The Valley of Knockinore, everybody. And uh, it's a gorgeous, gorgeous song. Uh, it comes from uh, the south of Ireland. It goes like this. You may sing or speak about Easter week or the heroes of 98 Of the Fenian men who roam the glen in victory or defeat And their names in history pages told their memories will endure song of our darling sons in the valley of Nocanur. Well, there were Welch and Lyons and the Dalton boys, and they were young and in their prime as they rambled to our lonesome spots where the blackened tans did lie and republican bold they did uphold though outlawed on the moor and side by side they fought and they died in the valley of Nocturne Took him down beyond the fence where the flowers they were in full bloom, and they made him kneel down upon the grass for to face his final doom. And then Dalton he spoke as his voice it broke out with passion, proud and pure. Oh, for Ireland I'll die as I face the sky in the valley of Nocturne. Well, the summer sun was sinking now between the hills and the sea, and the 
pale, pale moon It was rising high, far out from Trabby Town Oh, on the dismal stars, on the clouds afar They are darkening o'er the moor And the banshee cried when her sons they died Thank you very much, folks. Thanks very much, ladies and gentlemen. While I was, while I was singing that song, I was just watching a spider making a web in my hand. And it reminded me of last week, uh, well, two or three days ago, actually. Uh, I just came from Milwaukee, Irish Folk Fest. And, uh, it was, it was lovely and all, but it's, 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 you know, it was really, really lovely festival. It was absolutely massive, but it's great to be back home and it's great to be over here in Shrewsbury. This is our first time here and uh, it's really, really lovely to be here, everybody. And the same as over there, uh, there's a lot of volunteers that are, are working here at this festival. And I'd like for you to give all the volunteers and the people that are helping out a big round of applause because without those guys, you know, you know yourself. And the sound men as well, everybody. I was going to keep them till the end. But uh, we've, got Graham. we've got Graham down there giving us out the sound in the front of the house, and we've got Ash up here giving us the monitors and, and Lawrence and everybody, all the crew. We work with them all the time, and they're absolutely fantastic people. We actually walked in here today, and we saw the guys, and we went, great, let's just drink beer. It's going to be fine. <laughs> so, but we didn't. I didn't, anyway. I'm drinking water, and uh, it's great. It's going well so far. Uh, well, <clears throat> we came all the way over on the Ryanair flight today, everybody. Would have been, it would be an absolute sin to not have uh, Robbie demonstrate uh, the bower on for you. Would you like to see that? Yeah. Well, this is Robbie Walsh, in my opinion, one of the best bower on players that ever lived. I'm telling you that now. And he's here he is, he's going to do a demonstration. No pressure. Definitely the best bower on player on the stage.
Hold a limb, the woman in our town, the woman you all do well. Oh, she loved her husband dearly, and another man twice as well. Oh, me right, finna canary, oh, me tip finna go all. Me right, finna canary, oh, what tip and up to Nancy? As she went into the chemist shop for remedies to find how you anything in your chemist shop to make me husband blind. Oh, me right, Finnegan Airy, oh, me tip Finnegan, oh, all oh, me right, Finnegan Airy, oh, we're tipping her up to Nancy. Said she give him eggs and marrow bones and make him suck them all. Oh, and before he has the last one sucked, he won't see you at all. I'll oh, be right, Finnegan Airy, oh, me tip Finnegan, oh, all oh, be right, Finnegan Airy, oh, we're tipping her up to Nancy. Well, she gave him eggs and marrow bones, she made him suck them all over before he had the last one sucked, he couldn't see her at all. Me right, Finnegan Airy, oh, me tip Finnegan, oh, all oh, me right, Finnegan Airy, oh, and we're tipping her up to Nancy. Oh, well, if in this world I cannot see it here, I cannot stay. I think I'll go off and drown myself, come on, she says, I'll show you the way. Finnegan Airy, oh, me tip Finnegan, oh, all oh, me right, Finnegan Airy, oh, and we're tipping her up to Nancy. Well, she led him to the river, she led him to the bride, oh, but slying off a Martin, it was him that pushed her in, oh, be right, Finnegan Airy, oh, be tip Finnegan, oh, oh, be right, Finnegan Airy, oh, we're tipping her on to Nancy. Well, she swam through the river, oh, she swam towards the bride, crying, Martin, dear Martin, don't leave me behind. Shut up, shut up, dandy, you silly old fool, you know that I am blind. Me right, Finnegan Airy, oh, we're tipping her on to Nancy. Oh, there's nine in me family now, and none of them are me all. I wish that each and every man would come and claim his own one. Me right, Finnegan Airy, oh, and me tip Finnegan, oh, all oh, me right, Finnegan Airy, oh, and we're tipping our to Nancy. And I lived a woman in our town, a woman you all do well. She loved her husband dearly, and another man twice as well. Oh, me right, Finnegan Airy, oh, and me tip Finnegan, oh, all me right, Finnegan Airy, oh, and we're tipping our up, oh, me right. Finnegan Airy, oh, me tip Finnegan, oh, all me right, Finnegan Airy, oh, tipping her up to Nancy. Thank you very much, everybody. Mr. Robbie Waltz in the bear on. Go on. <laughs> we doing all right for time. We doing okay, yeah. Is everybody okay? I played all tune on the heist, Yeah. Right. yeah of course. Unfortunately, it's come to that point of the night where I'm going to play a tune. Ash? Take, that, take this down. Yeah, yeah, thanks, man. That's um, what it is. That's what fucked me up. Thanks. And it's a very cheery tune. It's a very happy festival kind of a tune. Um, it's a very, very old tune, actually. And it's, uh, it's called Gullamon Sonar in Irish. Um, so who speaks Irish or Gaelic around here? Do you have, have you any Irish? Um, the Gael talked over there. So Golden Sonar, it translates to the the crying of the women amongst the slaughter. Great stuff. Not the lovely. Not the happiest of titles, I'll be honest, you know, snappy, wooden settle front page like. Um, <laughs> but it's a very, very, very old piece of music, and it's um the, the whole piece itself is about 28 minutes long, so we're going to close the doors. Um, so get comfortable. And we're all going to be here together for the next, you know, make friends with your neighbour. <laughs> um, but actually, a bit of trivia for you, it's actually the first recorded piece of music on the Illum Pipes. Um, recorded by a man called Mickey Kumba of Suluan from Dingle. And Mickey Kumba of Suluan from Dingle, he also had to deal with lights and open doors. Which are notoriously difficult for pipes. Look, it's Grant. We're close enough, aren't we? <laughs> now, I'm going to get very serious, like, so I want a lot of...
concentration, right? Here we go. I've built this up now. I better. I better do a good job now, Leggy. Oh my god. <laughs>
Maggie O'Connell, everybody, on the pipes. Apparently, the Illum pipes are the hardest instrument to keep in tune. I'm definitely in the right band. <laughs> this one's called Pat Rainey, everyone. Ladies and gentlemen, 
We're going to do one more, I think, and then we're finished. We're going to get off the stage, and then we're going to go out to the CD tent. If anybody wants to come over and say hello, please do come over and say hello. We're uh, great crack. We're great crack all together, and uh, <laughs> it's going to be it's, it's it's fantastic. I hope that you enjoyed it. Everybody enjoyed it. The trio, yeah. <laughs> you never know. Something mad like we could be back next year might happen. You never know. That'd be gas, wouldn't it? Fast off. That'd be very funny. Will we do it? Will we give it a lash and see what happens? I don't know. Yeah. Will we do the whole lot of it? Or? Let's do the whole lot of it. I don't want to annoy God. anybody. Okay. Let's, let's piss off the organizers. No. <laughs> Come on, what do you reckon? Will you piss off the organizers? <laughs> no. <laughs> no, we won't do that. We won't. <laughs> That's one of the organizers. Will you mind him for a minute? Thanks, I am a true born Irish man. I travel around my, my home's the road. I must travel till I die. Though few men give me camping space, I and fewer call me friend. On a hard road for the traveling man, I must travel. Till the end Hunger, hardships and poverty And the travellers weary load Hunger, hardships and poverty And the blue tide I came to Dublin City Fair in the year of 59. And I camped in Lansdowne's Grim Valley with honours of my kind. Oh, but Dublin's Good Christians to a man Tore down our camp and uprooted us And dragged out our caravans Hunger, hardships and poverty And the travellers we're And poverty and the blue tar out here in Cherry Orchard, no cherry blossoms bloom. We are forgotten and Dart and muck and gloom. But the man above who died for love and was nailed on to a tree. Well, wasn't he a traveling man, the same as you and Lift 
to travel ours weary load and we'll bid farewell to poverty and the blue road. Lovely stuff. Thank you very much, everybody. Thanks a lot. We had another set of reels to play, but you're luck next year. Thanks a million. Ladies and gentlemen. Yes, yes. Ladies and gentlemen, Derry Farrell Trio. Fantastic. Go. Let's set the bar pretty high, I think. Um, don't go away. Our fantastic crew are going to...